Hey! Good afternoon, everybody. It's, uh, it's been a minute. I didn't stream on Tuesday because, uh, I don't know. Just couldn't find the motivation, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I've been playing some of the N64 expansion pass. Uh, I haven't yet played Ocarina of Time on here. I heard it had some issues. Hopefully that gets patched out eventually, but, uh, we'll see if we run into any. Uh, I'm gonna try and keep it updated as I switch between games, but unfortunately, the Twitch app is not super great at uh, keeping up with that, so if it's on the wrong game, apologies. You know, but uh, let's get into this. I haven't played Ocarina of Time in a, god, probably like a friggin' decade. I'm not, as you'll probably know from the, um, from the uh, video I made about it, I'm not the biggest fan of the game. But, uh, I like it well enough. Yeah. And I do have a ton of nostalgia for it, because, come on. Growing up with, like, the, in the N64 era, this game was, you know, this game was the thing. Sorry, I'm really out of breath. I'm pretty out of breath, because I just did, uh, some jumping jacks and push-ups to try and get my blood moving a little bit, so apologies for that. The children of the forest, the Kakairi, live here with me. Each Kakairi has his or her own guardian fairy. I guess it'd be the Kokiri, if we're going Japanese. However, there is one boy who does not have a fairy. And that is... that guy? Aw, oh, snap. Nightmare time. I gotta say, this game is very cinematic in a way a lot of games couldn't be yet. Um, I, I feel like people remember the story and, like, cinematic moments like this more so than any other part, really. Like, the gameplay's pretty fun, and I can remember a decent amount of the dungeons, but, like... If you quizzed me on what happens in each dungeon, I probably wouldn't be able to tell you. Navi. Navi, where art thou? Come hither. Get the Pepto Bismol. If you haven't watched uh, Terminal Montage's animation on Ocarina of Time, I highly recommend them. They're really funny. Yeah, I don't need to do all that. It's Ocarina of Time. We know how it goes. Go find Link. Have him help things. I guess in this case, Iggy, because that's who I am. Mm-hmm. Yep. See, yeah, this was the big thing in general, is like... Cutscenes in this game are a little much. Being able to skip them would be very, very helpful. Come on now. Let's go, let's go. Whoa, first person. This was pretty cool in the uh, 3DS remake of this. Switching to 3D for this bit, at least. Hello. Um, I've, in a, a lot of ways, the 3DS remake were like really, it, it, it made a lot of really good decisions. One of the best ones being having uh, having two items on buttons, but then two items on toggle. So like say, your iron boots in the water temple. Great help. Like, it makes the water temple so much more bearable. Being able to do that, and then also just having the map right there on the bottom screen. Um, so yeah, for the most part, I'd recommend that version over any other just for that. Alright, get up, get up, get up. Um, hold on a sec. Let me see. Okay. I played uh, played through Star Fox and some other games, but I wanted to be sure that the the button mapping was the same for all of them, which it is. It's, it's strange. Y, which I feel like Y should be A, but er, well, uh, okay, Y should be B, B should be A, um, X should be left. C and A should be bottom C, but they kind of like twisted that around. 
So B is B, A is A, Y is left C, X is down C. But if you hold ZR, then you can use the uh, directional buttons as the C button, so that's not terrible. It's just a little, a little strange. Can I roll yet? Yeah! Boy, uh, it becomes very clear that this is just a static image looking at it in HD. Oh well. Listen, they had to make concessions somewhere. Being able to make a game as expansive as this on this hardware was, like, pretty impressive still. Pretty sure it's, like, 20 megabytes. Hello. I'm not gonna bother with doing voice lines for this. I'm just gonna skip through as quick as I can. We all know Ocarina of Time. The music. I think the music is really what elevates this game more than anything else. Because it, it is still one of the best, like, retro soundtracks. Or honestly, just one of the best soundtracks in general. So good. Alright, let's go through. If you haven't played Ocarina of Time, apologies, I just... I, I've played at least this opening bit a bajillion times. So, I'm not gonna dawdle around. We're just gonna... we're gonna zip right through as far as I can get for a little bit. Whoa, 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 whoa. Guess uh, my sibling is gonna get to see the McElroy brothers live in a couple months. That's pretty cool. Can I? Can I not sword? I just got. Do I have to equip it? I do have to equip it. And yeah, let's save. Huzzah! Adventure! Huzzah! Alright, and now I need to grind out 50 rupees to get a shield. Which is, you know, the more obnoxious part of this opening bit. At the same time, though, the Kokiri Forest is, like, the... The, like, gold standard for, like, tutorial areas, you know? Da -da. Yep. I mm, yeah, I know. Mm -hmm. hey. oh, whoop, there we go. Uh, back flip, side jumps. Jump attack. Do a little jump. Do a little jump. Cool. Oh. Is it a toggle? I thought it was always holding Z. Huh. I, I do not want to speak. I wanted to pick the rock up if I could. I guess not. Oh well. Get. Do rocks even give you rupees if you break them? It has been quite a while. 
Oh, there's a guy over here who can't, like, lift any of them. Yeah, okay, some of them do. I think it's set up in a way so that you have to get, like, everything to really get all 50 rupees. I don't recall, though, for certain. Could just be, like, faster. Nah, you can't grab the one he's trying to pick up. I want to help him. He's trying to pick up a rock. I could pick up a rock. I guess he's want me to help him pick up a rock. Okay. Let's go round back. Climb? Yes. Yes, climbing. Ooh, secret. That wasn't even the one I was going for, I don't think. No, it was. I, it was the one I saw. Climbing. Mm, nothing up here, okay. There's like a bridge somewhere. I don't remember where it's at, though. Shake a stone. Whoa! Oof, that felt like it was right on the edge of doing damage. They probably set it up so that you can't actually hurt yourself in this opening area, right? Or like, not, not seriously hurt yourself at least. Can't even get that one. Okay. Grab. Break. Grab. Break. Grab. 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 Nothing else to grab, huh? Well, eight more. Can I get them from swimming? I remember that being a thing. All right. Do you like just swim along, and sometimes you get a rupee? Guess not. Nope, rock. Do I get money for this rock? Nope. This is yes, this is how I get on the bridge. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. It has been a while. Um You can... Can you center the camera? I don't remember. Ah, whatever. I got it. Three more! Where can I find three more rupees? Come on. Come on. I could probably shred some... Some grass for them. Ah, I guess I gotta look inside. There's probably some pots to break. Aha! Break. And... Break. Oh, that's two. I need one more. Come on. Come on. Where is a single rupee? Any of this grass. Any of this grass. There we go. Alright, we're ready to go. Where is the shop? Uh, I think it's over on this end of town. Yeah, there it is. You can see the fairy, which is a clever thing to do. How you can see the fairies from a good distance. Um. But you don't see the character model until you get closer. It is just a pr I always thought it was- was it hold? Did they change that? Just like, the tiniest change, but like, did they change that? I remember it being like a holding the button thing. Oh! 
So just Z's. Okay. I should have thought that since it's a camera thing. Whatever. Hey, bud. Um. Give me the shield. Oh, it's only 40? I remember it being 50. Okay. Either they change stuff or my memory is just wrong. Whatever. Gotta stay hydrated. No, I'm good. Oh, and uh, let me equip um, the shield. Alright, let's talk to Mido. Yep, I, I did do that. Oh, it doesn't say their names in the corner. I remember it saying that. Maybe it's just because he says the great Mido if you talk to him before this. Or, he says right there. <laughs> really has been a while since I played this. Yeah, I played the original, but I never got very far. And then I played the... 3DS remake all the way through, so apologies if I'm a little off on some of this stuff. Get got, get got, get got. Give me a stick. Deku stick. Don't waste your sticks. Let's, uh, equip some stick. I uh, will equip it to this. Okay. Another great Deku Tree, uh, cutscene. So, just, uh, let me respond to my sibling here. What do they got to say? Hmm. All right, doesn't just auto go. Uh. Okay. Yep. My vile climate prevails the land. I'm not gonna do that. I might do a full playthrough of this at some point, but like, right now I'm just messing around. Yes. I hate that it. Why does it bother doing that? Because if you do know, it basically just repeats, right? And if it's like. If it's like a direction, it's like, okay, I missed it, maybe I should listen again, but like... I find it very frustrating that it does it on something like that, where it's like... Pretty clear what's going on. Dang, I already... Lost a heart, huh? Let's, uh... Let's get these Deku sticks. At the very least, maybe one of them will drop a heart. I remember in, like, elementary school, uh, someone bringing their manual for Ocarina of Time to school and just, like, looking through that at the art and, like, seeing Goma and just, like, the gorgeous, like, painted artwork, like, oh, it was so, it was so captivating and I was so excited to play it. Um, I mostly watched my uncle play it originally and then my, like, little brother went through most of it, but, uh... 
yeah, it's it, it's a fascinating thing. It's like a cultural like touchstone for really my entire generation. Whoops. Yeah. Get out of here. Get out of here. Give me the Deku nut. Let's, uh... Oh, wait. Um... I really, really wish you could choose how you assign the buttons in this. Because I am I tried, desperately, to get the N64 wireless controller. And I'm, I'm still going to get it as soon as I can, but like... Man, yeah, some bits of this are, uh... Some bits of this... Are, are, are just annoying. It's just annoying uh, not being able to, like, reassign Z to, like, the bumper or whatever. Or, like, reassign which of the C buttons are X and Y. It's, like, it's, yeah, it's, it's not the worst, and it's definitely tolerable, but it's also, like, I paid extra for this. I feel like I should be given the option, at least. Look at this wall. Maybe I can. Oh, and the right stick is also the C buttons. Well, that's useful. Watch out, watch out. Link, watch out! I guess I gotta come back. Or, oh, I didn't even notice this big old chest right here. It's been a while. Oh, good. Okay, okay. Listen. Hmm. Right, I forgot. Navi. Because once you get a little ways into the game, she's not that obnoxious, but like, oh boy. Alright, what is it? 32 is number one, I think? Oh, no, it's... It's, it's that bit, huh? Hey, thanks for the heart, at least. Oh. Oh, I guess that was supposed to be a shortcut. Oops. Maybe it's just the way back. I found the fairy slingshot. Okay, let's uh, sign that to that, and we'll sign that to there. Y'all got anything cool? Deku seeds. Nice. Wow, that stuff grows back like immediately. So how am I supposed to get back? Oh, I see. Uh, that? Cool. Ah, uh, yeah. I'm going to try not to hit A while climbing up. 
but uh, my Breath of the Wild senses are going to be like, you can jump while climbing a ladder. You cannot jump while climbing these ladders. And get him. Oh, okay. Just one slingshot. That's not too bad. Gotta watch out for any other sculptulas. Oh. oh. Hold on, let's, uh... Can I get him? Oh, I just barely... Oh, no. No, oh, he's just a little too high. All right, let's scoot back a little. There we go. You ain't got nothing for me? Rude. Rude. That's what that is. then cool come back up ooh two rupees well that's some art generous I get any sort of bonus. Large box. Compass. Nice. Gotta get the sword out first. Oh, didn't even give me a heart back, huh? Tears. Oh, what's that? What's that sound? Is there a gold skull chilling? Somewhere about? Ah, eh, not that I can see. Oh well. Oh no, there he is. That's it. And just a heart. Nah, that's dumb. I destroyed a gold sculptula and got a token provided proving pro 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 I did it. I did indeed kill him. It was me, officer. I murdered the sculptula. Whoops. back. Stop it. 
Steady the sword. Then do it. Oh my god, come on. What is going on? There we go. Jesus, why was that so hard? Uh, I think there's like a specifically longer one you're supposed to go off of. Nope, doesn't look like it. All right, here we go. Wow, Navi, what? What do you want? And she doesn't even have anything to say now. Hey, what's up? Can I help you, madam? What am I supposed to... Uh, do I do it with the sword? Oh, there's a heart there. I'll keep that in mind, I guess. Oh my god, I gotta deal with all these guys again? God damn. Thankfully, I am still a crack shot with a slingshot. Nope, what am I doing? Another guy up there. They never really explained how to do it specifically with the slingshot, but you basically just have to get it in that little triangle between the string and the two, like, arms of it. You know, once you get that, it's like, it's pretty consistent every time. Can I go up higher? I feel like if I go up higher, maybe. There's no fire here that I can tell. Ah, oh, you son of a butt. Good. Do the thing, Link. Oh my goodness. Hold on. Might have a work thing. Just a second. Hmm. I might get this. We will see. Hold on. <sighs> Two more seconds. Huh? Project not assignable. Whatever. I am definitely like... I have, uh... Definitely... Got in my quota, basically. My my self-imposed quota. For the uh for the week of work. But you know. There we go. I I don't know if I needed to do the sword, but it helped, I think. Whoops. Get back up. Come on, Link. Goodness. Yep. Link, get out of the water. Give me the Deku nuts. Thank you. Um, I believe I have to move like a block, right? Some. Oh yeah, I can climb. Is this a different one, or is this the same one again? Yeah, it's the same one. Okay, uh, I think this is just, oh, I can just climb over to here. Right. Oh, ooh, watch out. Hmm, can I not do that? Oh, 
I destroyed a gold skull trolla. Can I just like... No, you fall like straight down. Well, how am I supposed to do this again? Uh, can I just climb? No, I can just climb on this. This isn't that high up. Okay, this is definitely more gold skull chillas. They've definitely done something to this, haven't they? There's no way there was three gold skull chillas. Hold on, am I playing the right version? I feel like I might be playing the PAL version or something then. Cause like this feels just slightly off. I don't know, it feels like they made it like a little bit easier. Not like a lot, but like just a little bit. Hmm, something about it. I don't know what it is. Hold on, where's the... Oh, I see, I see. Careful. There we go. Ah, dang it. Took too long. And my Deku stick is gone. Whoop! Okay. There we go. I solved the puzzle. Oh. That's fine. I got plenty of those. Alright. Try it, buddy boy. I got him. Will you teach me? In the proper order, 32 is number one, right? Tw oh. 23 is number one. Whatever. You are a traitor. But... It works out for me, so I don't really care. If you hold down A, you can dive. I bet there's some interesting things underwater. I mean, yeah, okay. Like what? Oh, the button here. Right, I see your tricks. Go, go, go. Come on. Hurry up. Go the other way, go the other way. Go, 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 go. Hey, there we go. Whoa. and grab hold of it with A. I swear, I don't remember her forcefully interjecting this either. I remember this bit being optional. Okay. Lime. Thank you. Oh, jeez. No, I didn't want him to be a stick. Crap, not gonna have to do it like this. All right, two torches. Mm, 
You got him. Oh, something dropped behind me. What was that? Oh, little Gomas. I don't remember this happening. That's interesting. Is this like the master quest or something? I mean, this makes more sense for them to like pop up a little earlier in the stage. Dungeon. here. Ah, you butthole. I'm probably gonna play until after the Goma fight and then uh, switch over to a different game. I wanna check out what the heck Sin, Sin and Punishment and uh, Winback are all about. Cause those are the weird ones in this, this set. There we go. And we've returned. If you did a hack of this to make the cutscene skippable, speed up movements like pushing the block there, and like just over overall like making it a little bit, you know, snappier, a little bit quicker, it would really do a a, a lot to make this game a lot more fun on like replays. Because the first time it's it's super fun just because it's still really fresh and new to you. But then on replays it can be a little bit obnoxious because it's like, well, I don't want to go through the whole, like, creation myth of Hyrule again. Oh, wait, uh, 23 is number one. Jadora Secrets. Thanks. Oh, Queenie. Can Goma even talk? Seems, uh, seems unlikely. Sure, for people afraid of spiders, this is a really scary fight, but uh, as someone who doesn't have that particular fear, I just found this a little bit like, you know, I didn't really get it. And you look up, oh no, Mako. Oh my god, up there, what's that? She's so jiggly. She's so jiggly. Ready my stuff. All right, keep an eye on her. Oh, whoops! How to deal with these? 
All right. Where's she at, though? Where's she at, though? Oh, there she is. All right. Oh, hold on. I might have a project. What is this? The instructions here are upbeat, mind blown. Ready for a new career. Hurry up and apply. That's a little much, guys. Come on. You and I both know this. there's no way that this is that exciting. Oh, I didn't get it. Oh, well. It's been a bit competitive lately, but that's all right. Uh, seems like a silly time to say, but you know. Come on, drop the eggs. Drop them. Oof. Come on. Log on to her! God, what the? That was obnoxious. Why wouldn't it lock onto her? Yeah, let's save. I kept hitting Z. I, I hit it over and over, looking straight at her. Let's, let's go up. Do I gotta do the... Okay, cool. It does just... Throw you right in if you've already played. Played a. Okay. Yep. Go on then. There's a project, hold on. Once again, vulnerable and let it make us fall in love with the boy next door when it's just, it's a concert announcement. What are you doing? It's too much. Too much, guys. Like just say excited or something. It doesn't need to be this specific. I didn't get that one either. Whatever. Okay. Where's she coming? Okay. Come on then. Drop the eggs. Thank you. Oh my god. 
on. The amount of time she spends stunned is just real low for like a first boss. go. Took her down. A heart container. Nice. And let's, uh, let's save. Okay, that's going to do it for that one. I'm going to take a quick break, but I'll be back in just a minute, so don't go anywhere. Don't touch the internet dial. I'll be right back with more Nintendo 64 in just a bit.
Hey, I'm back. Uh, yeah, we're gonna try out the two weird ones here. Operation Winback and uh, Sin and Punishment. I've never heard of these games prior. I guess Sin and Punishment has a couple nods in uh, the Smash Brothers series, but as far as like, you know, sequels or anything, has not happened. Uh, oh, I guess I should do the tutorial first, right? Seems optional, but... That's what you guys went with? <laughs> okay. Seems, uh, ill-advised as a name for your, your stuff. Jean-Luc! That's the main guy's name? Jean-Luc? This is very odd. Press R. Press it now. Yeah, I'm, I'm pressing it. Doing well. Okay. Press the A button while holding down the R button. Okay. Thank you. To reload, press the B button. Okay. Oh, okay. Uh, press the A button near a wall. To put your back to the wall. Okay. Shooting around a corner. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Z button to crouch. Okay. Uh. Roll. Got it. Up button to change weapons. Wow. Uh, sure. Yep, moving the camera. Sure. Uh, well, I guess just this one. Oh, the lock on is uh down, huh? Now try it. Ah, I see. Hmm. I missed what he said last. That's not great. Anything important. Uh, sure. Hand to hand. Strike with your gun butt when behind them. Sure. Sure. Cool. 
cool. shot it. Do I need to shoot more? Oh, okay. I guess it wasn't loaded in yet. Got a little ahead of myself. Yeah. Hey, button. Got it. Exploded. We're here. Uh, was the boxes. Mine. Mine. Okay, pal. Oh, do I even have C4? Okay. Now I do. And then... Cool. I guess that's just in case you mess up and blow yourself up. A little training run, alright. Sure. get in here. Okay. I'm doing quite well, thank you. Mm -hmm. Sure? Oh, I see. The fuck, it's not locking on. No, that wasn't that hard. It's actually pretty easy. <laughs> Again, you probably shouldn't have said that. You shouldn't have had that as your guys' name. All right, let's get into it. Nova West Mountains. West Ham. As you know, the speed. Uh, as you know. Hey, instead of uh, doing that, maybe you, get, you should have started us at a point where you told them originally. Because nobody says, as you know. That's stupid. Even just asking them, like, what, what did we tell you to, like, check? 
Like, that's less of an annoying cliche. Yeah, military nonsense. Don't care. Go into mission. Oh, okay. So this is just like one of the original cover shooters, I guess. Yeah, it's fine. Not really blown away by any part of it, but it's like not terrible. I'm entertained. Switch the shotgun. I'm much more a fan of the shotgun. Magazine. What kind? Oh. Uh, anybody back here? Any secrets? No? Okay. Oh, wait. Somebody drop something? Oh, no, that's supposed to be fire. Yeah, I don't know why it's brown, but alright. Do I not have the range to hit that guy? Oh. There we go. Can I pick up a health pack anywhere, please? Did I jump out so dang hard? I didn't want to do that. Yeah, this is fine. It feels very arcadey in a lot of ways, like uh, it's something we would have played in the arcades back around this time. I've certainly, I've certainly played worse. A laser trap. One slip and I'd be a crispy critter. <laughs> Fantastic. I think this would do well with some, uh, some voiceover. Like some, uh, Resident Evil style voiceover. Especially hard, but this is still the first level, so I really can't uh, can't attest to how hard it could get. Where do I go now? Oh, hey, who's this? Shotgun shells. Well, I do prefer a shotgun. Anything good? A magazine. Okay. Whoops. Uh, 
God, lock back on. Stupid, lock back on the friggin' box. Could I get some health, please? I, I'd appreciate it. Whoa! Game's pretty clunky. I mean, I'm glad to try it out at least. That's one of the more fun things about these packs is that you'll you'll get to play some of the weird stuff. Like, um, I was playing what was it? Mighty Mighty Bomber guy, Mighty Mighty Bomb Jack for the NES. I only played that because it was in the NES pack for Switch Online, and it's it's not good. It's a it's a pile of friggin' gibberish, but it's like interesting at least. Come on now, come on now. There we go. You got anything for me? Whoop! Uh oh. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. also one of those things like Call of Duty where it's like most of the areas are just like uh, government silo canal desert base it's like it's just the most banal kind of friggin areas you could think of for a video game oh ah, dang it Yeah. Mm, no. I don't think. I might play this more later on my own, but uh That was not very interesting. All right, let's switch over to Sin and Punishment. See how that goes. Sin and Punishment. That looks correct. Yes, so hopefully it is actually ch switching it. If it's the incorrect game, apologies. Treasure! Oh yeah, treasure is really good. Archie. Archie, hurry. I have high hopes for this. No, shut down! Are these the rebels? One group of them, sir. They have no Oh yeah, bad N64 era voice acting. Love it. There's no time now. Join the troops intercepting the ruffians. Whoa. Alright, let's I don't care. Whoa. Might have a project. Let's Let's see if I can get this. Oh, cool. All 
Already loving the soundtrack, the super shred and electric guitar. Hell yeah. Did I get it? I did get it, sweet. Things are coming up Iggy. Oops, there's another one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's ah, one of these where they try and sneak in words by being like, this acronym should be read as this. This acronym should be read as this. It's like, guys, just put it in. It's like five extra words. You don't have to be such a cheapskate. Come on. Come on. Get this one. Nope. That one's not assignable. Oh, well. I'll keep an eye on it. Alright. Let's see what Sin and Punishment is all about. Train it. Let's just start game and hopefully it'll explain everything. In game. Uh, how do I... Oh. Oh! Oh, this is like a shmup. Oh, this is weird. Okay. Da, 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 da. That's strange. Don't have a lot of control over where the cursor goes. Get bonus. Um Yeah, this is this is weird. Okay. Kind of loving it actually, but it's a little, it's, it's odd. It's just running through a field shooting bugs? Most of these guys aren't even coming after me, so I don't know why I'm doing this. Uh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay. Whoa. Yeah, this is almost like Star Fox. This is weird. Come on, come on, bee seamer. Get bonus. Get bonus. Get bonus. Hello, friend. Hello. Uh oh, the time's going now. Feel like I'm running out. This is weird. This is a very odd game. Not in a bad way. It's very strange, but it's like interesting. Oh jeez. Okay, was I supposed to jump there? What is I'm still not fully certain what's going on. Uh I'm just kind of shooting off their like feet. Oh. Time bonus. Am I supposed to be dodging those? Ah, I can jump. It's the R button. The R button is jump? What is this? This is very odd. Ruffians in memory. I guess I just gotta go ham on him. Uh, did I win? This is... This is ridiculous. <laughs> okay, you can skip cutscenes at least, so that's cool. Mmm, those textures are hard to look at. Saki. Oh, Saki. Good morning, Saki. Good morning, Iron. Whoa, whoa, oh, 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 okay. This is ridiculous. I actually kind of adore this. Come on, we've got work to do. I cannot tell if it's good, but it is very interesting. Oh, I just got blow stuff up.
This is actually kind of great. I'll be honest, I'm having a really good time with this. It's like a rail shooter. Or like a shmup. I mean, rail shooters are kind of like shmups, but like with uh, FPS more. Um, it's weird that it's like in, it's English dub, but it's like still Japanese subtitles. Ow. Oh, but can I get those, please? Ow, what's going on? I don't have control over where I move. <laughs> the poses, oh my God, the poses are ridiculous. I gotta say, I do really like this. I wish I knew what I was doing, other than like shooting, I guess. I keep making it seem like I can like move left to right. I, as far as I can tell, I can't. I can switch the color of my um, crosshair. I don't know why I'd want to. Hey, were they implying that those bugs at the beginning were like a dream? Oh, well, I could have jumped over that. Okay, that one was my bad. Nope, here's more of the bugs, so I guess they were real. This is dumb. I I, I love it, but it's really dumb. Well, this is gibberish. I'm just, I'm just mashing. I'm not even mashing. I'm holding. Hello? Wow, okay, I just, wow, I don't even know what to say about this. How do I, ah, hey, what the heck? It's like right on me immediately, what's going on here? Can I like, can I like melee him? Can I melee? Oh, you can't, what? No, you can move left and right with the, with the D-pad. You move left and right with the D-pad while you have to use the trigger. How did they expect you to play this? Iron, cover our what? So you had to use Z to fire while using, were you supposed to like hold it with the left two prongs? How does this work? I am very confused by how this would have worked originally. You're not using the C buttons. You're not really using the A or B very much either, so I guess it's... I guess it would have been like you use the left two prong, but then you have to use R to ch jump, so like, how would you have held the controller for this? This is bonkers. Okay, this is just jump rope right now. I, I did it, I did it. I don't know how I did it, but I did it. Which one do I have on this project? Oops. Five minutes. Okay. Come on, quick, into Shinjuku Station. Hurry, the ruffian swarm has started attacking. <laughs> I honestly, I kind of love the English dub here. I keep trying to read the hiragana, but I'm just, I, it's too fast. I'm not that good. Wait, oh, wait a minute. Oh, you can use either, so you could use the C buttons. Wait, what? I am very, very confused by this. Maybe it's because I'm not using an actual, like, N64 controller, but like, I'm trying to wrap my head around how you would have moved. 
Hold on, let me check the user guide. So, okay, either the left... So I'm moving around with the D-pad. Z is shoot. R is jump. Like R, the bumper. I'm so confused here. And honestly, it feels better to be able to use the right stick to move the crosshair, though. Um, just because, like, modern FPSs, you're always using the right stick. This is... this is funky. So, I guess... So I guess you would have used the left two prongs? I've never seen an N64 game that did that. But yeah, it feels like you must have had to use the... The left... Wait, so... Yeah, and then you use whatever... So you'd use L? To jump? What? It, what? Oh, well, it did warn me. I was literally thinking, what's that skull there? This is weird. I like it. I like it a lot, but like, I'm very confused. Oh, uh, wait a minute. Let's back. This is bonkers. This is so weird. I'm going to give it another shot. Um Skip the small fry. Capturing Radon is our top priority. Right, right, right. What am I doing? Use the right stick. In fact, I could just do it. Yeah, I can just do it like modern FPS. Wow, this is weird. I get, I got the bonus. Don't get on my case about it. Transport, Iron, take the control. Hurry, Stocky! I can't get over the English voice acting. It's so corny, but I kind of love it. I, I can't deny, I kind of love it. Hmm. Rafine's commander. Wait, was that a melee? Do I have a melee? Oh my god. What's going on? How am I supposed to deal with this? Well, I have a roll move. He's got a lot of health. What? Jump, jump. Yeah, this is very strange, but it's really good. Oh my god, oh my god. Knock him off, knock him off the side. Checking. Yeah, you would have just used the left two prongs for this game. As far as I can tell. I don't 
don't know how else you would have done it. Get him, get him, get him. Get him on the ropes. the time oh never mind the time is ticking down oh no my friend she's dead whoop oh, well crap I don't know if I'm gonna win this one I'm not doing a lot of damage Uh, I switched to red. I think it's doing more damage. Is that a thing? Is it like an Ikaruga thing? I think I'm just gonna run out of time. I think I'm just gonna run out of time. I don't know what else I could really do about it. Oh, if I like point it at him straight on, does that do more damage? No. Not as long as you hit him, I guess. This boss fight's really tedious. Unless there's like something else I should be doing here. Can't tell. Yeah, I'm gonna start taking damage. Oh, <sighs> I'm dead. Oh wow, wow, what was that? That was so weird. <laughs> Holy crap. This is an odd, odd game. I think I'll definitely be playing more of it, but like, I'm so confused by it. So confused. That's, yeah. Game over. <laughs> That's how you say that? Okay. <laughs> God, I miss the days of really bad English dub. Because I was just saying the other day, it's like I prefer old English dubs of anime and stuff over modern dubs. Because modern dubs, they try and still fail. But in the old ones, it's like... It was usually like whoever bought the license for like 50 bucks from Japan getting his buddies in like literally a treehouse, according to um, Steve Bloom. He recorded his first like anime dubs in a literal treehouse. <laughs> and uh, yeah, it, it wasn't good, but it had like a charm to it. Whereas modern day dubs, it's like actors who are like trying their hardest. And it's just, uh, it's just not good great um but yeah very weird game uh i'm gonna have to end here because i got some work to do but i will probably play some more of these long term i think i'm 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 surprisingly enjoying them so thank you very much for choosing iggy kid streams for your streaming entertainment i know you have a great deal of selection when it comes to streaming entertainment nowadays and i appreciate you choosing me Please be sure to check out the past streams on the past broadcast tab or on Iggy Kid Twitch Archive. That's Iggy Kid, one word, Twitch Archive on YouTube. That's linked down below on the browser version along with my regular YouTube and my Twitter at IggyDKid. Follow me in all those places. Follow me here. Subscribe. Use your Twitch Prime sub, which if you have Amazon Prime, connect the two accounts. You get a free sub every month. Use it on me. Thanks, because I know you will. Uh, I will be back on Saturday with something... Um, maybe more Jackbox, if you guys can behave. That was a bit of an annoyance, but I did have fun with it. So maybe more Jackbox, I don't know. But tune in on Saturday for that. Follow to see what it is. And, uh, hey, if no one else has told you this, I'll tell you this. You're a good kid. 
Thanks for watching, everybody. Let's see if there's anyone to raid over to. Um, Jason Bain, James, Saura. Let's do Saura streaming. All right. Let's get that going here. Uh, let me actually switch over to the end screen. It will all begin. And let's see. Sla uh, slash read. Saura streaming. I think I did that correctly. Yep, here we go. All right, let her know I sent you. Have a great rest of your week. See y'all on Saturday. Okay, goodbye. Goodbye. Goodbye.